Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hey, it's Nick here with Spice and Grew. Hey, I got Brad with me. I've seen him on a bunch of other videos. We've got two new hot sauces for you to try. This is going to be part one of two of Scotty Ohati brand. Scotty Ohati, they're made in Michigan, uh, just from what I've kind of read up on. So before we get started, though, referencing the last couple videos I've made, we're doing a giveaway, okay? So when we reach 500 subscribers, I'll be buying a uh, one lucky winner a bottle of satan's blood okay i'll purchase it and ship it to you free of cost okay a couple videos ago we did that and it Ooh, was it's freaking bad so this is bad. so if you're watching this you need to subscribe to the youtube channel and you also need to hit the bell icon so you get notifications straight to your phone whenever we upload and then you need to go over to our facebook page spicy guru and give that page a like okay and in the description of this video i will put the link in there all right so again, we have Scotty Ohati. Okay, we got two of them. Uh, the first one we're going to look at is roasted pepper sauce. Roasted pepper sauce. I think it's more of a bell pepper base. I don't expect this one to be all that hot. Uh, their little slogan is called the Motor City Hot Sauce. Made in Michigan. It's got the uh, you know bell peppers, different things like that on the maybe with some tomatoes on there on the logo there. Uh, going around the label, this fire roasted veggie sauce is a chef favorite, combining mouth watering ingredients with just enough heat to spice up any dish. The robust flavor will give a jalapeno level, level kick hmm. to any dish, soup, stew, seafood, Mexican wings, or marinade. Owens Family Foods makes it, scottyohati.com. I'll put the link in the description. Uh, run by some of the ingredients on this bad boy as tomatoes, like I said in the in the picture there. Uh, beer, onion, roasted bell pepper, vinegar, tomato sauce, mango, carrots, tomato paste, water, roasted garlic, jalapenos, radishes, a little bit of cayenne, olive oil, sea salt, peppercorn, peppercorn, honey, assorted spices, liquid smoke, vinegar, and Xanax gum. All right, it don't sound too hot. Uh, I think it's gonna be like it's kind of like your regular like table sauce, yeah, but like a table sauce, right? Yeah, we give we give the world here. Let's take this little thing off there. It's, it's got good color to it. Great color to consistency. it. Consistency, medium consistency. Don't look too runny, but also don't look all that thick. Got some chunks in there. Mm -hmm, definitely. Some little flavor bits. Scotty oh hottie. Let's hope Check it's not Scotty too hottie. You right. know. So we'll see. Ooh, smells great. What do you think? Ooh, that does smell very good. Mm. Oh, yeah, it's definitely got the oh, sweet yeah. pepper smell. Let me get you some on it. Let's get it. Let's get it here. Is it coming out? Get a good little dose of this one, you know. It's probably going to be a little bit sweeter. But, yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely pick up on the pepper. Don't mind him. Nope. <laughs> Please silence your cell phones. Mm -hmm. Turn off all cameras. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Let's give it a try. Yeah, let's see what we got. Mm. It is super mild. Yeah, it's not hot at all. I think most of the spice out of that is probably coming from the pepper. I'm trying I mean, to put my finger on what that compares to. You want you want it to taste like to me? It tastes like veggie straws, like little something chips. like that. Yeah, that's what it tastes like. That's it's good. just like a zesty veggie straw. Yeah, that's good. I mean, it's, it's not spicy at all. It's good. It's got like a little peppery kick. Yeah, that's, that's really it. more or less what it is. It's it's mm. more pepper than it is spice. But you can definitely get, you know, like the sweeter notes the. The bell peppers and a little bit of the tomato yeah, that's in there. Good. It is good. That's it's a good really all-around sauce. That's not even... I wouldn't even really classify that as a hot sauce. Yeah. But that is just a good all-around sauce for any kind of type of food. So if you have somebody in your house that just really can't tolerate stuff at all... But want a little extra liquid on their food. want that little bit know? of extra flavor, that layer of flavor, this would be really good for them. I mean, like, yeah. there is just... It's just like you just over-pepper your food, but you get... The extra flavor from the peppers and and the tomato, that, that little bit of underlying vinegar taste. Yeah, heat scale one. 
Yeah, it barely. Even a if one. it's a one, but I'll put a, I'll put a soft slap of one on it. Good job, Scotty Ohati. That's a good um, normal sauce. sauce. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. So, uh, yeah, definitely great. Uh, if you want to run down this, uh, the next one here, this one's going to be a little hotter. I don't think I this feeling. one's going to be anything like that one. No. I mean, this is the Scotty O'Hotty's old number two premium habanero sauce. And it's got the color of the habanero for sure. Um, let's see. This one is made with fresh habanero peppers. Add this multi-award winning sauce to beef, pork, chicken, and fish. To wake it up, it's excellent in Bloody Marys, dips, barbecue, chili, Tex-Mex dishes, and pasta. From my family to yours, have you had your drop today? From <laughs> Owens Family Foods. So, it's an all-natural, sugar-free, low-sodium. And uh, it's got a lot of the same characteristics as the, uh, as the roasted pepper. Some tomato, uh, it's got beer in it again. Um, water, barley, malt, rice, yeast, hops, onion, habanero, roasted bell peppers, vinegar, tomato sauce, mango, carrots, tomato paste, some roasted garlic, some jalapenos, radishes, some cayenne, olive oil, sea salt, peppercorn, honey, sort of spices, liquid smoke, and the rest of the good stuff in there as well. So we'll take a look at this one, some Scotty O Hotties. It says hot right here on the label. Got some fire <laughs> down below. It smells like habanero. Does it? It really does. That looks so mm. far it looks like more of a runnier consistency. It is. It's a little bit lighter. Um, can't really tell a whole lot. There's some small chunks, but not not like the consistency that this one is. You can see that this one kind of just hangs in the top of the yeah. That one's a, top a little of the clingy, bottle. Little so that's a little bit thicker. This one's a little thinner. It's got a good smell to it. Yeah, see that one is it, it is quite a bit thinner. Scotty, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, no trouble, yeah, no trouble popping out there. Mm -hmm. So we'll give this one yeah, a shot and see what here. we think. It smells good. Yeah, you can taste habanero right away. Mm -hmm. Straight away. Yeah, that's straight burn. Mm. That's good though, but it's not. It's gone. It's not too much. It's, it's, it's I mean, it gone. levels out really fast, and it yeah. just kind of goes right back down. It's one of the lighter habanero sauces. Yeah, it's uh, it's good though because it has that that habanero flavor that just pound right in your face up front. Habanero it, flavor kind of wings it off. It peaks so. really fast, and then it starts declining. It doesn't doesn't linger around it kind of leads you wanting for more this one's really good yeah that's um that is this is something tasty. that i would just kind of have around oh, just definitely. for just for a good all around you know moderate heat level hot sauce mm -hmm. what would you say on the heat level of that one i'd get like a three that's gonna say that man three yeah two and a like half three somewhere like there. that's a good uh i've had i've had hotter habanero based hot sauces say, yeah we did i can say this is yeah. <laughs> I've had uh I've had hotter habanero habanero yeah. is harder to say sometimes uh based hot sauces than that but uh, they really tamed that down I'm sure maybe the beer helps with that so definitely check that out scottyohati.com I'll put the links in the description there look out for part two we got a ghost pepper and a beer bacon chipotle I believe it is from the same company so look out Some for part two Scotty on that. coming at so, you Remember the giveaway, 500 subscribers, I'll give one bottle away to one lucky winner of Satan's Blood, mm -hmm. so subscribe, you've got to subscribe, people, we need to get this channel booming, okay, like I said last video as well, over half of you guys that's watching are not even subscribed, so what's stopping you from hitting the subscribe button, like, down there, like, right, in that right general right vicinity, alright, hit it, hit it, Smack so, it. until next time, peace. See you.